Uh, so yes, anyway, not those good old, not those good old <laughs> days. Uh, the good old days back, um, I think it was way back in February, okay, uh, yeah. when we were allowed to go places and get yes, together and things. Yes. Um, so Phil and Roz, where were you on the night of Friday the 28th and Saturday the 29th of February? Bernard had encouraged us to go out to out west to the induction service at Walgett right. and then at Lightning Ridge. And the induction service at Walgett was for uh, uh, George Ferguson, George Ferguson that's well. right, yeah. and uh, Kurt and Rebecca Langmead at Lightning Ridge. Mm. So we were there for their induction services. What, what else is in common with those particular two parishes? Well, they're, they're, they're both uh, part of BCA, Bush, yeah. Bush and Church Aid. The diocese, our diocese. Yeah. 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 So, uh, yeah, so there's something going on between BCA and our diocese. Yes, yeah. that's right. Yeah, good. This is George's first position as a, as a minister, yeah. but he'd been somewhere else before that. Yes. He's South Tamworth. He, yeah. That's right. He'd he, spent two years, I think, yes, yeah, at... Uh, with um, Lord Chiswell. Yeah. He it was an Indigenous trainee course, ministry yeah. trainee course. Yep. Yeah. And he he did that. And that was with BCA. Who was the, that was with BCA. Yes. Yeah. As well. So yeah. under Rod. Mm. Yes. Okay. Uh, so tell us about the service. Uh, people were gathering from all over the place, and I read somewhere that they had 120 actually right. turned up. Yeah. And uh, yeah, Rick Lewis, our bishop, uh, he uh, he led the service, mm -hmm. and then the BCA people. Uh, who's the national director, that's uh, Greg and Karen Harris. Harris. Yep. They took part in the service, and it was a great service of praise and, and uh, also inducting uh, the Fergusons into the ministry okay. there. Great time, we yeah, enjoyed it. it was an and awesome they gave us a meal at the end of all this. And I think they were really only catering for about 80 people, and about 120 were there. So that, that was great encouragement for the Fergusons. That was uh, Friday night, then yeah. what happened? And then the next morning... Uh, we were invited to breakfast at the uh, at, at the back vicarage. of the at the vicarage, which right. is at the back of the church. Yep. And uh, this is where we met uh, the Langmeads, uh, Kurt and Rebecca, and the family. Yeah. And then they gave us a lovely breakfast. And I understand that they've done this uh, for a while, providing breakfast for the town on a Friday. I think, if, yeah, if where possible. Right. right. And before COVID, this was a as, an, as an open invitation. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so great. That's a great outreach ministry. Yeah. Yeah. And they also. Now, in COVID times, they live stream their service onto the local radio. Okay. Uh, so that's cool. great. Yeah. That is terrific. Every Sunday out. morning. So yeah. that's wonderful. Yeah. So both isolated, which is where BCA comes in, really, doesn't yes. it? Yeah. So tell us about BCA. Well, BCA is um, an organisation that uh, go the long distance to yep. try and um, tell people about Jesus in remote mm -hmm. and rural New South Wales. And they really are remote out there. Yeah. And uh, so they support those two churches. Yep. Ross and uh, really took a shine to it and got the information, and yeah, okay. uh, we we joined up. Yeah, good. Mm. Oh, so what 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 is having having joined up? What is that? Well, they what have these little happens? boxes. Um, you can just put your loose change, put your loose change in there, so that and then what twice a year, um, the people at the church in Narrabri, Dive, Dive area. area, and Irene Baldwin collect the money and yep. send it off to BCA. So it's just a way of putting your loose change to support the work of BCA. So that's a, a financial way of supporting? What yeah, else that is. Yeah. can they, and they, 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 they do? they print out this little book, uh, which has got the names and the photograph of um, of the people involved. All right. uh, mm, that's really great. So we, we actually have a link now with the Lightning Ridge uh, Church yes. and the Langmead. So... Yeah. Um, if you were to get that little book, would that would that would be particular prayer points? Mm. Yes. Um, yes. Yep. Uh, and I guess there would be stuff on their website as well. Oh, they have little videos there. It tells okay. you about their history and what they do. They're in every, every state and territory of Australia. Right. Okay. Mm. That's remote ones. Yeah. Mm. Sure. Mm. Good. Good. All right. Well, um, be worth praying about some of this stuff, wouldn't mm. it? Mm. Mm. Heavenly Father, we do thank you for uh, the work of the Bush uh, Church Aid uh, over these last hundred years. Uh, we thank you for the men and women committing to having the gospel pro proclaimed in these isolated areas. Uh, we thank you for all the people who have come to Christ uh, through uh, through these people that you've brought in. And uh, we do particularly pray for uh, the Langmeads and the Fergusons. Um, and it would be a difficult time for them. Uh, would you draw people to yourself through them? as they continue to preach the gospel, the gospel of Christ and uh, him as Saviour and Lord. We pray in his name. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Well, thank you, Phil and Ros, and thanks for this lovely spot. Yeah, pleasure. And um, we'll see you later. Good. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hello, all. It's that time of year again to pack your shoe boxes. Each box is a gift and opportunity for God's love to touch into a child, a family, and a community with the message of God's love through Jesus. Samaritan's Purse works through local churches and rotate around village areas and reach out to new villages only when invited. After receiving a shoebox, the children are invited to do a 12-lesson series called The Greatest Journey, where in just over 10 years, 23 million children around the globe have heard about Jesus and God's love for possibly the first time. So pick up a box or two, along with how to pack your sh a shoebox brochure from the vicarage. Please pray for the child who will receive your box. So get packing and return the boxes by the 18th of October to the Vicarage Front Veranda. Now if you have any questions or want boxes dropped off or picked up, please contact myself, Jeff Smith, or Ruth Smith, my wife, and Margaret Wood. Thank you for listening and enjoy your packing.